Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today I am just going to do a quick little video for the little craft cart that I put together with all of my December daily supplies. I did do it off camera, but I just wanted to do like a little run through of how I laid everything out and how I used those organizational pieces that I mentioned in my previous video. So right here up at the top, I've got all of my papers. So they're right out in the open. And then I have this little tiered acrylic piece, kind of sideways. It fits perfectly right next to the acrylic tray with the papers. So it fits right in there nice and perfect. So I've got all of my stamps for this year back here that I'm planning to use or that are Christmas themed. In this middle one, I just put all of my word phrase stickers, um, labels, tabs, and the chipboard stickers and stuff like that that I had left over from last year. And then I also have the little tabs from Allie Edwards and I still have quite a bit of room here if I wanted to add anything else in there. And then this first one didn't really change from my video. I've got all of my ribbons, all of my sequins, and then I added in my brads just in case I want to use those as well. Also a decent amount of room left in here. I've got all of the leftover sequins just kind of setting here. I also have these pops of color. These were freebies with scrapbook.com orders. So I figured since they were Christmas colors, I would just paste them right there. And then I have my aqua pigment. This is just some yarn that I had found. <laughs> I don't really necessarily need that in here. I just, I think I moved it from one of the bottom shelves. Um, but I'm probably just going to leave it in there because I do want to do some embroidering and stuff like that this year. I've got a long little like organizer down there at the bottom just with some longer embellishments in it. And then here is my little organizer tray. So this is my embellishment tray and then underneath that I've got another little embellishment with my embroidery floss and all that good stuff in there. And then these two alpha stickers that were in the citrus twist kits for Halloween. And then down on the next shelf, scooch down here, I've got these little dividers, if you can see them right there. These are from Michaels and you can get them and they fit in this little thing perfectly. Everything right here is just normal dies, like everyday dies that I have. These ones are all the Christmas dies, and I just tucked them right along in there. These are all ones that I showed in my video. I've got a scoreboard, and then my transparency six by eight papers I just kind of stuck right there I'm still not entirely sure if they're gonna stay there or if I will move them in a, to a different spot and I've got these two boxes that the kids usually come in this one has a bunch of random numbers in it and journaling cards this one just is full of all sorts of random stuff so it's a hodgepodge of different things. This one is just kind of, I guess, a catch-all box, if you will. And then everything at the bottom is nothing to do with December Daily. These are all kits. And then my other journaling cards and some extra little bins and stuff like that. So that is all I have. And then I also have my large trimmer back here. And I decided to put this on the cart instead of leaving it where I normally have it, just because I figured it would be a little bit easier to obtain and to get to when I'm trying to do like a daily video or a daily craft or something like that. I also stuck a couple of my go-to tools 
like my tweezers, my bone folder, and then this little pick tool from Simon Says Stamp. I also stuck those in this little embellishment tray as well. But that is really all that there is to it and all that I've got set up for right now. I do on my desk have a little bin of alpha stickers and then just a little bin of like enamel dots and stuff like that that I'm thinking I might add to this tray but I haven't fully decided yet. If I do, they'll probably just end up in this little catch-all bin and just kind of rest right there just in case I need to access them for whatever reason. But this is how I am set up to work on my December daily this year. If you uh, have a craft cart set up, let me know down in the comments below. If you've got something similar set up to this or if you've got an idea that maybe I haven't thought of that would work better for my space. So since we're talking about my space, this is what I'm kind of working with right now. This over here is where I'm generally crafting. So my craft cart, when I am not crafting, ooh, will sit right here at the edge of my desk. So that's kind of my whole space right there. And then when I am crafting, I'll probably just kind of tug it to be like right here. And then that way it's right next to me and everything's easy and arms reach. Anyways, let me know down in the comments below what your thoughts are or if you have any suggestions for me. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope to see you in the next one and I hope you have a great rest of your day. Bye!